Right now at five, a walking miracle. That's what the mother of a 14 year old girl is saying this evening after her daughter survived after being shot several times by her teen boyfriend. Mm. Investigators say Jasmine was shot in the head three times by her 14 year old boyfriend when she tried to break up with him. <laughs> Wow, what's the motherfucker that can't deal, man? Welcome back to Sheldon's Bootleg Ass Studio, where you come to kick it, vibe out, and shoot this shit with Sheldon. Listen, if you ain't subscribed to the channel by now, you're doing myself and yourself a disservice. Go ahead, hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, and tap that notification bell as well. That way, you are amongst those who are notified as soon as I release new content. Also, don't be shy. Drop me some in that comment section. That way, I can familiarize myself with you and recognize who you are as we are reacting to the videos or covering this news like we're doing today. And I appreciate each and every last one of my views. So, if you drop me some in that comment section, and then I see it, I will respond to it. So you might just want to be on your best behavior. Because if you's a troll, I will get on your dog ass. Indubitably. Video of today. Unfortunate situation, man. What's up, man? We got a 14-year-old boy that shot his teenage girlfriend in the head three times because she wanted to break up with him. And the mother speaks out, is what it says. This don't make no sense, man. Who raising these kids? Who's raising these kids out here? Now, I know we can't put the blame on the parents, but damn. They watching somebody. They getting this shit from somebody. Anyway, let's jump up into it right now. Says a walking miracle. That's what the mother of a 14-year-old girl is saying after her daughter survived being shot several times in the head by her teen boyfriend. Pirelli said her daughter, Jasmine is talking, walking, and smiling at Children's Wisconsin just two days after being shot several times. She said her daughter is still her spunky self and is looking forward to putting on makeup. Investigators say Jasmine was shot in the head three times by her 14-year-old boyfriend when she tried to break up with him. And that's why, yeah, you see why she was trying to get rid of him? Because she don't need to be with him. That, yeah, bro. Yeah. That's... They say the boyfriend admitted to shooting her in what he called a fit of rage. Did they mean a bit of rage or a fit of rage? Like he threw a fit. I don't know, but that's what they got. Anyway, let's go and jump up into this news clip. Right now at five, a walking miracle. That's what the mother of a 14-year-old girl is saying this evening after her daughter survived after being shot several times by her teen boyfriend. Mm. This happened over the weekend near 21st and Memorial Drive in Racine. That boy is charged as an adult. Uba Ali sat down with the girl's mom who tells us how her daughter is defying the odds. She's just so proud to be alive. Miranda Perales says her 14-year-old daughter, Jasmine Jones, is talking, walking, and smiling at Children's Wisconsin just two days after being shot several times. She's still her spunky self. She can't wait to put on her makeup. Investigators say Jasmine was shot in the head three times by her 14-year-old boyfriend when she tried to break up with him. They say the boyfriend admitted to shooting Jasmine in what he called a, quote, fit of rage. I had no idea. No idea he had a gun. Guess it was a fit. says her daughter dated the teen for more than a year. So he described himself as, as throwing a fit, basically. Yeah. Yeah, you got a whole lot of maturing to, to do, young sir. To shooting Jasleen in what he called a, quote, fit of rage. I had no idea. No idea he had a gun. Perales says her daughter dated the teen for more than a year. She never noticed any concerning signs. Mm. I bought the kid Christmas presents, you know? I mean, you never know that type of stuff. She probably was hiding it from you, mama. And he was doing a good damn job of acting. Yeah, like, whoa. Up until the mask is unveiled. This is truly domestic violence at age 14. Oh. Did you ever think that was even possible? I did not think that was possible. I did not think that was possible just because they're kids. And I didn't think Man. evil was in kids. The 14-year-old is charged as an adult Sheesh. with attempted first degree. So a bunch of these little demons running around his mom. She better get to believing it, baby. Intentional homicide. Considering the trauma, Jasmine. I'm sorry to tell you. Miracle. Her family is thankful her brain function wasn't impacted. Mm. She's lost sight in one of her eyes. Um, but 
The doctors Dang. told her she's going to be able to do everything that a people with two eyes can do. Jasmine will also have to live with several bullets lodged in her body. Man. She's taking the worst day of her life. God gave her the second chance. And using it to speak up for those in violent relationships. This is her new path and, and I'm gonna help her in every way possible. Yeah, she said she, she gonna use that as a way of speaking to those in pretty much domestic violent relationship like y'all see them red flags man y'all need to start backpedaling and getting the getting the hell up out of there get the f you feel me get up out of there you see them red flags they are showing you for a reason and you need to read them as such and get the f yeah oh god fortunately this young baby right here got a second chance at life and I hope that uh, that 13, was he 13? Did they say how old he was? I don't know why I think he, I just gave him to be 13. Anyway, the young boy, I hope he get charged and dealt with accordingly. And I hope he learned from this, for sure. Cause he got a second chance as well. He'll get a second chance, he'll get out. That's what I'm getting at. Anyway, let me know what you think about this in the comment section below. If you vibed all the way out to the end, I really do appreciate you. Make sure you hit that like button and subscribe to the channel if you hadn't already. You feel me? And uh, we on Facebook, YouTube, Twitch, the exact same name, Sheldon Vibes. No space in between. And it's a Z at the end. Oh, God. Until next time, I'm Sheldon Vibes. I'm going to need y'all to be cool like the other side of the pillow. Stay light on your toes like you suppose. <laughs> Oh yeah, no. If you ain't fucking with my nigga Sheldon, nigga, fuck you. Yeah. Oh God.